So Keith, if you could just talk to us about your expertise and your role in the organisation. Okay. Well, my, my, my role is to help people get clients. You know, you people run their businesses often on emotion. They, they think, oh, but I'm, I'm going to help people and because I'm helping people, they'll help me and they'll come and see me and everything will all work out okay. It doesn't work like that. You're running a business and you have to be aware that you're running a business. So my role is to help you to get new clients by applying a strategy, a process, and I've tried and tested many strategies over the years. I was a therapist myself uh, for 12 years. And what that's shown me is what works and what doesn't. And I want you to learn with my money so you don't have to waste your own. So I'm going to help you, support you, and show you the strategies that you can use to make your business successful. But the point I would make is your business won't be successful just by fluffy stuff and, and trying to say, well, I'm great at this, so people will find me, they'll want to book me because I'm so great. They won't. There's a lot of choice out there. The people that are most successful are those that not only can help clients, they're those that can get the clients in the first place. And to do that, you need a marketing strategy, a marketing budget, and you need to take action. And a lot of practitioners aren't very afraid with the web or some of these other vehicles for marketing. What, how can you help them? The web is becoming increasingly um, the most popular place to find new clients. Um, or rather for new clients to find you and so you need to have a, a strong web presence and what I can do is to show people how to turn their website into a marketing machine so that clients can not only find them but they can use it to build relationships on autopilot. The, um, if you haven't got a strong web presence, if your website is not a marketing machine for you then you're losing opportunities and so it's critical to get that right.